Climax molybdenum, strengthening the world, connecting the future. More than two miles high, atop the continental divide, a new chapter unfolds in a story that began more than 100 years ago. Leadville, a name that conjures an era gone by. Prospectors, the Old West, Doc Holliday, Buffalo Bill Cody. Today, in this place rich in history and lore, and in other locations around the globe, people are at work, producing metals that will play a critical role in connecting the future. Climax Molybdenum Company is the world's leading producer of a metal that makes our lives more productive, stronger, and safer. You wouldn't know it, but it surrounds us in our homes, our modes of transportation, electronics, and in the way we communicate. It's the metal with the name that can be hard to pronounce. Mo. Lib, den, um, molybdenum, molly for short. However you say it, here is its story. Molybdenum is a metal found in nature. You might remember it as one of the elements on the periodic table, M, O. The major sources of it are found in North and South America and China. This is the story of Climax molybdenum the world's most important producer of this essential metal. It's a story that begins in 1879 when a man named Charles Center saw a large gray mineralized outcropping on the western slope of Bartlett Mountain in the Colorado Rockies. Two decades later, samples of this mineral were identified as molybdenite and scientists were beginning to discover a world of use for this hot new metal. Then in 1918, Max Schott, a businessman and miner, formed the Climax Molybdenum Company to recover and process the material we call molybdenum, or molly. The name Climax can be traced back to a railroad station built atop the Continental Divide, the climax of a long rail journey from Denver to the mining town of Leadville. Molly's first widespread use was in our nation's defense. It replaced tungsten and manganese in armor plating and tanks in World War I. By the time of the Second World War, it was the go-to metal for strengthening battle vehicles. As society progressed and demanded new products, science discovered new applications for Molly throughout the 20th century and it has since become an integral part of our daily lives. Its usage is wide-ranging from stainless steel to paint, the refinement of fuels that power our cars, and Climax has been involved with Molly's development every step of the way. Today, the Climax Molybdenum Company, now owned by Freeport McMoran Copper and Gold, has grown to become an international leader in mining and producing high-quality Mali products. Our primary mines are located along the Continental Divide in the Rocky Mountains of Colorado, and our byproduct mines are located in Arizona and Peru, where Freeport McMoran mines copper. Several state-of-the-art processing facilities reach globally, from Arizona to Iowa to the United Kingdom and the Netherlands. Wherever the people of Climax are at work, they strive to advance molybdenum technology and provide solutions for customers and beyond. In short, Climax is Molly. It is what we do. The cornerstone of Climax's operations lies in the heart of the Rocky Mountains. The Henderson Mine, near Empire, Colorado, has been in operation since 1976 and is the world's largest primary producer of molybdenum. This mine has produced over 1 billion pounds of molly in its 35 years and has another 400 million pounds remaining in known ore reserves. At capacity, Henderson can produce 35 to 40 million pounds annually. 
The molybdenum containing ore is mined using an underground block caving technique. 10 ton capacity loaders, side dumping trucks specifically designed for this operation, move the ore from draw points to an underground crusher. There, the rock is reduced to soccer ball sized particles and sent to the concentrator 15 miles away. One of the world's largest conveyor belts of its kind carries the ore through a 10 mile long tunnel traversing the Continental Divide. Also located in the Colorado Rockies near Leadville is the Climax Mine, our original operation. The Climax Mine contains one of the largest high quality and low cost molybdenum ore bodies in North America. The new processing facilities commissioned in 2012 provide the mine with the infrastructure to deliver high quality molybdenum to the global market for many years to come. At the Climax Mine, located at over 11,000 feet in elevation, the ore is mined from an open pit using large earth-moving equipment with shovels capable of scooping 65 tons of rock at once and haul trucks that can transport 190 tons per truckload. The ore is transported to the concentrator just downhill from the mine. First mined in 1918, almost 2 billion pounds of molybdenum have been produced from this historic mining operation. The current operation has the capacity to produce 30 million pounds of molybdenum annually, with almost 600 million pounds of recoverable molybdenum in current reserves. A company is nothing without its people, and we all share a culture that places safety and occupational health at the very center of our work. Climax is an industry leader in safety, committed to the continual improvement in safety performance and the mitigation of health risks across its global operations. This key priority is delivered through robust management systems, mandatory training, safety incentive programs, and proactive occupational health initiatives. We also lead the industry in sustainable development. It is a common thread of commitment that runs through all of Freeport McMoran's and Climax Molybdenum's operations. It means safely providing a product the world needs today in a way that limits the environmental and social impact so that Climax does not compromise the ability of future generations to successfully meet their needs. This commitment begins inside the company with a pledge to create and nurture a safe and healthy, well-trained and motivated workforce. It extends to neighboring communities and to all who hold a major stake in our operations. Among our core values is a commitment to help support healthy and vibrant communities wherever we work. An example of this commitment is exhibited in our mine reclamation work. This is the process of taking land once used by the operation and converting it into productive land use or restoring it back to its natural state. With the closure of the Urad mine in 1974, the first comprehensive mine reclamation project in Colorado was initiated and completed using biosolids from local domestic wastewater facilities as a soil amendment. This visionary high altitude mine reclamation technique created the flourishing meadowland found at the Urad site today. Another Climax Reclamation project is the 770-acre Robinson Tailing Storage Facility. This site is where the sand residue that remains after valuable minerals are extracted from the ore is stored. Today, it is transforming into a green mountain valley habitat. Along with the biosolids from domestic wastewater facilities, this project incorporates wood chips from felled pine trees that have died due to the regional bark beetle infestation. Mining is the biggest part of Climax's business, but much happens down the line to bring essential products to a broad range of industries and into our daily lives. One of the company's major advantages for clients is our unique mine-to-market production capability. This means that Climax has the ability to produce marketable value-added products from the molybdenum ore we mine. There are many steps along the way, and it all begins with reducing the size of the rock particles we mine from our underground and open pit mines. Through numerous steps, the ore is crushed through the milling process to a fine sand consistency. 
From it, we separate the mineral molybdenite from the remaining rock using a process called flotation, which ultimately produces molybdenum concentrate. This concentrate is then shipped to processing facilities to create the value-added products. The first step in producing molybdenum products from concentrate occurs at our conversion plants in Fort Madison, Iowa, Green Valley in Baghdad, Arizona, and Rotterdam in the Netherlands. Our byproduct Mali concentrate produced at sites other than the primary Mali mines is mostly used in production of technical grade molybdic oxide that goes directly into global metallurgical markets. Ferromolybdenum, produced at our facility in Stowmarket, United Kingdom, is also used in this market. Used primarily as an alloying element in the production of specialty steels, molybdenum is a key ingredient in the global metallurgical market, which consumes about 80% of the world's annual molly supply. Certain construction steels require molybdenum alloys to increase corrosion resistance, strength, and hardening ability. Stainless steels contain molybdenum primarily for its corrosion resistance qualities, ideal for industrial and marine environments. In combination with other metals, Mali will give high-speed steels increased hardness and toughness, requirements for cutting tools such as drills and blades. Molybdenum also provides high temperature strength, hardness, and creep resistance in cast iron. Superalloys are employed in transportation applications such as exhaust manifolds and jet engines. The concentrate from the primary Mali mines, Henderson and Climax, provides high purity molybdic oxide which is necessary for the production of chemical products. Although only 20% of the world's molybdenum market, a larger percentage of Climax molybdenum sales are directed to the chemical market. This is where some of it ends up. Oil refineries, where our product ammonium molybdate is used in petroleum desulfurization. This helps countries throughout the world meet clean air standards. The automotive industry, where our high purity molybdenum disulfide and pure molybdenum oxides are used in lubricants that are especially effective in extreme temperature environments. This is another example of how molybdenum containing products have environmentally beneficial qualities as these lubricants increase fuel economy. Molybdenum metal and alloys are used in a number of important end products, including lamp application, glass melting electrodes, and electronic devices. Other applications include smoke suppressants and plastics using ammonium octamolybdate, and as a corrosion inhibitor in aqueous systems using sodium molybdate. Chemical grade molybdic oxide and sodium molybdates are used in pigments for paints, plastics, and inks. New technologies play an important role in Climax Molybdenum's product development. Our Climax Technology Center in Southern Arizona is a state-of-the-art metals processing plant that incorporates advanced technologies for the production of molybdenum metal powders and pellets suitable for many applications. Climax Molybdenum has held a worldwide leadership position in the production and marketing of this very important metal for more than a century and is positioned to lead the industry in the future. Anchored by our primary Mali mines in Colorado and supported by Byproduct Mali from Freeport McMoran's Copper Mines in Arizona and Peru, we hold the reserves, the technology, the products, and the people to reliably support global customers for many years to come. Climax Molybdenum, strengthening the world, connecting the future.